European cuisine, or alternatively Western cuisine, is a generalized term collectively referring to the cuisines of Europe and other Western countries, including depending on the definition that of Russia, as well as non-indigenous cuisines of Australasia, the Americas, Southern Africa, and Oceania, which derive substantial influence from European settlers in those regions. The term is used by East Asians to contrast with Asian styles of cooking, this is analogous to Westerners referring collectively to the cuisines of East Asian countries as Asian cuisine. When used by Westerners, the term may sometimes refer more specifically to cuisine in Europe. In this context, a synonym is continental cuisine, especially in British English. The cuisines of Western countries are diverse by themselves, although there are common characteristics that distinguish Western cooking from cuisines of Asian countries and others. Compared with traditional cooking of Asian countries, for example, meat is more prominent and substantial in serving size. Steak and cutlet in particular are common dishes across the West. Western cuisines also put substantial emphasis on grape wine and on sauces as condiments, seasonings, or accompaniments in part due to the difficulty of seasonings penetrating the often larger pieces of meat used in Western cooking. Many dairy products are utilized in the cooking process, except in Nouvelle cuisine. Cheeses are produced in hundreds of different varieties, and fermented milk products are also available in a wide selection. Wheat flour bread has long been the most common source of starch in this cuisine, along with pasta, dumplings and pastries. Although the potato has become a major starch plant in the diet of Europeans and their diaspora since the European colonization of the Americas, particularly in Northern Europe, maize is much less common in most European diets than it is in the Americas. However, corn meal, polenta or mamaliga, is a major part of the cuisine of Italy and the Balkans. Although flatbreads especially with toppings such as pizza or tart flambe and rice are eaten in Europe they do not constitute an ever present staple salads cold dishes with uncooked or cooked vegetables with sauce are an integral part of european cuisine formal european dinners are served in distinct courses European presentation evolved from service à la française, or bringing multiple dishes to the table at once into service à la russe where dishes are presented sequentially Usually, cold, hot and savory, and sweet dishes are served strictly separately in this order, as hors d'oeuvre or soup, as entree and main course, and as dessert. Dishes that are both sweet and savory were common earlier in ancient Roman cuisine, but are today uncommon, with sweet dishes being served only as dessert. A service where the guests are free to take food by themselves is termed a buffet, and is usually restricted to parties or holidays. Nevertheless, guests are expected to follow the same pattern. Historically, European cuisine has been developed in the European royal and noble courts. European nobility was usually arms-bearing and lived in separate manners in the countryside. The knife was the primary eating implement cutlery, and eating steaks and other foods that require cutting followed. In contrast in the sinosphere, the ruling class were the court officials, who had their food cut ready to eat in the kitchen, to be eaten with chopsticks. The knife was supplanted by the spoon for soups, while the fork was introduced later in the early modern period, ca. 16th century. Today, most dishes are intended to be eaten with cutlery and only a few finger foods can be eaten with the hands in polite company. <laughs> Central European cuisines All of these countries have their specialities. Austria is famous for their Wiener Schnitzel, a breaded veal cutlet served with a slice of lemon, the Czech Republic for their world-renowned beers. Germany for their world-famous Wursts, Hungary for their goulash. Slovakia is famous for their gnocchi-like Haluski pasta. Slovenia for their German and Italian-influenced cuisine, Poland for their world-famous pierogies which are a cross between a ravioli and an epinata. Liechtenstein and German-speaking Switzerland are famous for their Rosti and French-speaking Switzerland for their raclettes. Austrian cuisine Czech cuisine German cuisine Hungarian cuisine Polish cuisine Liechtensteiner cuisine Slovak cuisine Slovenian cuisine Swiss cuisine Eastern European cuisines Armenian cuisine Azerbaijani cuisine Belarusian cuisine Bulgarian cuisine Georgian cuisine Kazakh cuisine 
Moldovan cuisine Russian cuisine Chechen cuisine Komi cuisine Mordovian cuisine Tatar cuisine Udmurt cuisine Yamal cuisine Romanian cuisine Ukrainian cuisine Crimean Tatar cuisine Northern European cuisines British cuisine English cuisine Northern Irish cuisine Scottish cuisine Welsh cuisine Danish cuisine Estonian cuisine Faroese cuisine Finnish cuisine Icelandic cuisine Irish cuisine Latvian cuisine Lithuanian cuisine Norwegian cuisine Sami cuisine Swedish cuisine Topic Southern European cuisines Albanian cuisine Bosnia and Herzegovina cuisine Croatian cuisine Cypriot cuisine Gibraltarian cuisine Greek cuisine Greek Macedonian cuisine, Italian cuisine, Neapolitan cuisine, Sardinian cuisine, Sicilian cuisine, Tuscan cuisine, Venetian cuisine, Macedonian cuisine, Maltese cuisine, Montenegrin cuisine, Portuguese cuisine, Samaranese cuisine, Serbian cuisine, Kosovan cuisine, Spanish cuisine Andalusian cuisine, Aragonese cuisine, Asturian cuisine, Balearic cuisine, Basque cuisine, Canarian cuisine, Cantabrian cuisine, Castilian Leonese cuisine, Castilian Manchego cuisine, Catalan cuisine, Extremaduran cuisine, Galician cuisine, Menorcan cuisine, Valencian cuisine, Turkish cuisine Western European cuisines Belgian cuisine Dutch cuisine French cuisine Haute cuisine Cuisine classique Nouvelle cuisine Luxembourgian cuisine Monégasque cuisine Occitan cuisine See also Early modern European cuisine Latin American cuisine Medieval cuisine Mediterranean cuisine